Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. I'm the emperor of a really bizarre universe. Talk about the things that I have to research and find out, and study, and have come across and had to dissect mentally and figure out how that makes sense in reality. Certain things like um, the etheric uh, shadow people talked about shadow people there's <clears throat> there's interesting videos that I've come across where you actually see shadow shadows it looks like a formed like a not, I don't even know if it's the human you can just see movement and it's shadowy figures on videos in different aspects I've said one the one of the really good one was a lady just sitting in her living room with her phone and her dogs and she's like oh we're just sitting here for the evening watching TV and blah 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 she looks over and it pans to like the hallway in the kitchen or whatever and you see this like form coming around the corner and the dog react to it like what the hell right and, and she's like what the fuck yeah because you could see this like thing and then it, it kind of realized it was being she saw it and then it kind of dashed by yeah it was freaky so the reason why I bring this up <clears throat> Even my brother was dealing with it before he really had his episode and and went off the deep end and became homeless and had all his mental issues. But he was dealing with some stuff and I told him when I was living at the time and he took these pictures of this. It was a re it was really bizarre too because that night, amazing storm came through. I mean the whole area, and you could see lightning and thunder, blah blah. And he decided he wanted to go out and take pictures of it, right? So he got these pictures of this thing that looked like it was flying through the sky like a big creature, but it was, it only showed up in the camera, but not, and he couldn't see it visually, but he said it was just in the picture. And it showed two, and it almost looked like something flying, and then it showed a tail. It was really bizarre. And I told him, dude, that's not your world, dude. Don't get into it. Don't even go there. And he started looking to it and researching it and, you know, contacting um, move on and all these other places about UFOs and also I was like dude you don't need to get that deep into it bro I'm like this is not your world dude you don't understand it right so and anyways and the really weird part was later on when he called me one time like well he when he was at a I guess he was at a shelter and he called me and he was really going through it and he wasn't sleeping and blah blah, blah. and he said these fast people were messing with him and before he left his apart, his he lost his home, and his him and his wife separated, or she she left, she went to Phoenix, got the hell out of Dodge, and he was stuck in the home before he ended up kicking out. And he was videotaping something, and he goes, he said he saw like things moving around, and so he put his phone down and he videotaped something, and it actually showed something moving. It was really bizarre, and so he had proof of his something was messing with him, some entity was messing with him, right? And when anyway, so when he was calling me from the shelter and he was, you know, going through it and I was trying to talk to him, trying to understand what he was talking about. And he was saying these fast people were messing with his phone and they kept moving his phone while he was talking to him. And he said they would hit his phone and blah, blah, blah. And, and here's the thing is, as I try to get people to understand, there's, there is a spiritual aspect to this realm. We are functioning in a 3D and yet we are spiritual 5D creatures. So it is it a bizarre little, you know, two world kind of situation. And sometimes people get crossed in it to where they're, they're, they have, like, I have one foot in this and then one foot in the other, but that's because I'm a shaman. It's my job to have to, you know, to be exploring the, the other world, right? The, the spirit world. That's part of my gig. But most people aren't aren't tapped in for that. That's not their job, and that's not their path. And that's why I talk about ayahuasca and people taking that. And if you're not a shaman, practicing shaman or holy man, and, and it's not something you're going to use to heal other people, then you got to be careful because it's like it's not a quick fix. You, it takes years to heal yourself, and you're and going through, and you're never going to really heal. You're always going to be working on and bettering yourself. But it's like you're healing to the point where you can function as a human being again and be proper and in the all your chakras are aligned and all that good stuff. But yeah, they talked about the fast people. And I've had, I've heard other people talk about that too. And they talk about, um, yeah, there's p people on video where they're, they're sitting there and they take pictures and it shows their kids running around the room and then there shows other people in the room with the kids at the time. 
and the, or they'll show video where you'll see something fly through the room and the kids are like what the hell was that right and you show it slow down the video and to see it shows a human running through the room or something there's just bizarre there's you know the things that and here's the thing and they talk about revelations and all that stuff and i don't want to get into that too much they talk about the dead walking the earth and and you know we talk about spirituality blowing up tarot readings blowing up all that stuff spirituality on the on the internet is blowing up you know look at me i'm just you know <laughs> all into my light work right i didn't even expect this kind of thing right so it's happening so we got to deal with it and just like i said i'm going to talk about all kinds of different things in my channel but you know fast people is one of them shadow people these are interesting concepts you know light and darkness who's you know are they working for the darkness are they you know what i mean what what's going on like i talk about spectrum of light where you have creatures that are showing up on cameras that can detect different spectrums of light than human vision so that's kind of an interesting thought too anyway so yeah anyways that's just something to throw out and talk about but you know life's an interesting place and there's not just ghosts there's maybe there's people on different vibrations running around and you know different dimensional I don't know, cross dimensions, who knows, see, it gets weird, right? We'll get into it later, I'm just, there's just slicing off right now, just don't get too weird, because we can go on forever, right? Anyway, I love you, God loves you, and the universe is digging this shindig, baby, it's, it's pretty wild. Anyway, I love you, and have a wonderful day, goodbye.